Welcome to Card Snail, or welcome back if you're a regular viewer, where we try to buy slow and sell high. Today we're looking at one of the three different variations of Night Tim Burton's Nightmare Before Christmas trading cards. So this is an edition made by NECA. It is a Canadian-run item, so this is made in Canada for the Tim Burton Nightmare Before Christmas movie. It is it was a touchstone picture, one of my favorite movies of all time. A little backstory of me. As a kid, we always watched this movie at every holiday. It didn't matter if it was Thanksgiving, Easter. I, I have a strange family and a strange life, so that's just how it went. This is one of my favorite movies of all time. So we're looking up, looking for some Lock Shock Barrel cards. I mean, some Dr. Finkelstein. I'm not really sure what these look like or if there's inserts. It doesn't have a lot of information on the pack. I mean, these are very plain packaged items. And like I said, there's three different variations of The Nightmare Before Christmas that this is just one of. So let's get right into it. Not waste any more time. It's got a very uh, pro set panini feel of the packs, if I can say so myself really feels like the old pro set packs okay oh and it's got the names right on there so we got igor this is dr finkelstein's helper cyclops barrel okay that's awesome barrel he is one of boogie oogie boogie's henchmen those are my favorite guys lock shock and barrel are my favorite people um moody mayor it's not it's supposed to be switch face fetch which is he's playing fetch with zero i never realized jingle bells Christmas tree bats. This is a funny part of the movie when he starts trying to deliver gifts and it just terrorizes the world. Let's play. I love this part where Oogie Boogie is gambling for Santa Claus's life. Sandy Claus. I told you. And the fountain. The fountain is kind of like a centralized theme in this. It's like the town square. If you've never seen the movie, I don't know where you've been. I just, I feel terrible for you. Um, Go, go see the movie. I, I don't even know. I don't even know how to address people who haven't seen this movie. Just get out of here, really. Um, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. There's twelve cards per pack, so it's kind of a hefty pack. So witches nook. These witches are hilarious in the movie. Mayor mobile. So these cards are all different kinds of. I have to search for six surprises. Function draw three cards. Function function. I don't know how to play this game, so I'm gonna have to learn how to play the game afterwards. Decomposing guy, the well. Now this is not the fountain, this is the well. This is a different thing. This is part of uh, Dr. Finkelstein's castle, I believe. My fantasy, nutcracker, hide and seek. Hide and see his little, he is the little guys under a hat, under a hat. It's funny, he's like he got a nesting hat. It's like a monster with, it's a hilarious part. Master the plans, big witch, vampire lord, Town Hall, and the bunny. This is a funny part of You got to watch this movie. I don't even know. Helgamine. I did not know her name was Helgamine. So you can see that. Helgamine. I thought it was Big Witch, Small Witch, Medium Witch. I thought that's what they were called. But apparently her name's Helgamine. They don't really mention it in the movie. I don't believe. I mean, I can almost recite half the movie. Jack's Lament is one of my favorite songs. And I mean, I'm a grown adult. And Jack's Lament is one of my favorite. Behemoth. He's the guy with the bunny. Sally, great character. She ends up having her own movie. I believe there's a secondary movie about Jack and Sally. Jack's house. Mummy boy. Pull yourself together. She always has to break herself. She jumps out of the window to escape Dr. Finkelstein because he tries to own her like Frankenstein, but she's too sentient. She's too smart. So she jumps out the window and ends up breaking herself. So she always has to stitch herself back together. And she's like stuffed with leaves. I'm the boogeyman. Whoa, great part of the movie. Again, nothing about this movie ever disappoints. Moody Mayor, it's supposed to be Switch Face, I thought. Something's up with Jack. It's when he's studying, he comes back from Christmas World and is trying to figure out how to integrate it to his world. Fender Bender. Oogie's turn to Boogie. This is again when he's gambling with Santa Claus for his life. And Scared Stiff, Lock, Stock, and Barrel three of the funniest characters ever they just kidnap people for oogie boogie which is really i guess a pretty terrible premise but again they're they're funny characters so i haven't seen any holographic cards or anything like that i don't know if there's an insert set within this set bass player jim it's funny because he's got like uh like a talking puppet in his thing in his his bass i think it's a cello i don't know what it would be it's made of a coffin sally's room 
the mayor, the elected official. It's funny how they say he's an elected official, but his character is completely centralized around being a mayor forever. Jingle Bells, Double Dead, Sound of Rolling Dice, Fire. This is when they, they finally take Jack out. He's terrorized the whole world, delivering presents that just scare the bejesus out of everyone. And so they're firing anti-air craft missiles at him. Oh, look, we got a holographic. So there is holographics in this. Wheel of Torture Surprise. That's cool. That is cool. That's a really cool. It's got the Wheel of Torture. He's like about to cut Santa in half with this in this part of the movie. He's lowering Santa down. That is a really nice card. I love that. Okay, there is hollow. So there is in inserts in some fashion in this um, game. Jack's Bedroom. Little Witch. Zelda Born. So her Little Witch is named. So they are like, it is Big Witch, Medium, Little Witch, but her name's Zelda Born. The Treehouse. This is where at Oogie Boogie's house. Jack Skellington, Master of Fright. One of Jack's many skills is to take off his head or to make crazy faces. Sorry, I'm going slow. I love this movie. I could talk about this movie forever. Jack Skellington, the Pumpkin King. This is when he's singing Jack's Lament. Accordion player, Igor. Mr. Hyde, he's the one with the, the nesting hat. Halloween plans. It's funny, they act like they plan. Like, is this, we, we have to meticulously plan this thing, even though like they are all monsters and you don't have to plan that. My fantasies, surprise, three of a kind. Nutcracker, scorpion surprise. Town Meeting, Delightful Hat, and Oogie Boogie. He's probably the best character. Um, so I'm noticing, so there is different things. So this is like a spell or something. See, it's got just Jack the Pumpkin King. But then there's surprise cards. So it's like maybe an instant. Like these are something similar to an instant. And then creation cards. So it's like a secondary character. So like these are characters. Jack, accordion player, Igor. And then creations is maybe like an artifact. So it's almost something like uh, similar to Magic: The Gathering. We'll see. I'm not. Sh I'm not sure. I'm gonna. I'm gonna try to learn how to play, and I might do a secondary video of just playing a couple hands out of this game. Interesting new games like this that aren't popular to play. It's almost mo the more interesting part is how to learn how to play a game that almost no one knows. So Oogie's Lair, Doctor Finkelstein. He's the guy who made Sally. So he's the uh, like mad scientist. Lock. Oh, we got Lock. We haven't gotten stock though. Okay, Town Square, Jumbo Treat Bag. So there's Lock, Shock, Lock, Shock, and Barrel. Lock, I don't know why I call him Stock. His name's Shock. It's Lock, Shock, and Barrel. So we're missing Shock. We got Lock and Barrel. Shock is the girl. Mellow Trio, Takeoff Ramp, Public Transportation, Corpse Dad, Wolfman, Castle Finkelstein, and Eureka. So, yeah. Loving it. I'm noticing we haven't got a lot of doubles, which is nice, and but we also haven't got a lot of hollows, which is not nice. Sax player, James. He's, his name is James. See, I didn't know that. Actually, no, I do remember. At one scene, he's like, James, James. He talks to him. So, Corpse Kid, Ethan. This is a... If, if nothing else, this will teach you everybody's name, Ethan, because they do at like one point or another mention for a second. Finkelstein Hall, Witch's Nook. So, that is the second of both of those. We have Finkelstein Hook, Hall and Witch's Nook. Mary Antoinette doll, fetch. So we got two of those now. Throw a bone. He feeds Igor like he's a dog. It's really funny. Um, hitch a ride. The best I can. This is, oh, I'm doing the best I can. Oogie's oh, dice. They're loaded. They have little snakes in them. So like the dice are complete cheat dice. I'm not the dumb one. And this is Halloween. Really though, how do we not get shock yet? I feel like he pulled a lot of cards to have lock and barrel and not shock. The mayor, the electric case, okay, so now we're getting into doubles. Town Square, uh, several of those. Sally, so we're getting into a few all over. Decomposing Guy, Mellow Trio, Takeoff Ramp, Three of a Kind, Jumbo Treat Bag, Something's Up with Jack, Fender Bender, Deadly Nightshade. This is how she knocks out... Um, Dr. Finkelstein. So when she wants to escape, she puts Deadly Nightshade in his food. Which is funny because she has a giant jar that has Deadly Nightshade on it and he like doesn't know she has it somehow. 
and then Fear the Reaper. So we did not get a shock card. We are going to have to buy more of these packs and undo them. Like I said, that was the set for Nightmare Before Christmas. These packs are uh, three, four bucks, depending where you get them. Sometimes five to six dollars retail. I've seen them in retail shops, you know, like collector stores. They're a little bit more money there. But online, you can get them for five or six bucks maximum usually two or three maybe four dollars um if you want to check out the full set list of these cards you can check out the description of the video for links to my blog and there's also these will be available on my ebay store with much more cards available of different sets again guys thank you for watching as always buy slow and sell high Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, please like and subscribe and catch my latest unboxing adventures. Also, if you want to pick up these cards or any other sets you've seen, check the description for my eBay and blog that has packs, cards, boxes, and tons of other collectible swag. Guys, as always, buy slow, sell high.